How's it going everyone? Here in Puerto Rico. Just got off the plane. And uh, hold on, let me get past these. There we go, just got off the plane. And so, if you guys, if you're new to the channel, pretty much the first day in country, I try to get situated. That's what I'm headed to right now. Gonna go get a phone plan. And uh, as usual, Hold on, let me see if you can see it. Ooh, sweaty. Some of you guys you probably already know Puerto Rico is a U.S. territory, so your phone service should work from the states, from mainland. You know, uh, Verizon, AT&T, Cricket, Metro, all that good stuff. I just didn't have that. And plus, uh, Clado, I believe, is the plan. The plan that I want, Clado has. I'm just on a one month plan, super affordable. And that's pretty much it. I will say this, definitely getting a, you already know we're in the Caribbean and I'll knock across. Ooh. And if you can see to the right, I don't know if you see the three flags, there is a US flag, Puerto Rico, and then La Republica Dominicana. That's gonna be in the first impressions video. Obviously we're in the Caribbean, so you're gonna have some similarities, but walking through, definitely felt like, yeah, it brought back memories of my time in the DR, the bachata. They have cold models. You don't know what a cold model is, basically a mini market. And then at night it turns into like a bachata bar slash club. Okay, I see the store Colados on the right side. After that, plan to grab some grub and then head to the supermarket and see if I can show you guys some of those prices. But man, a lot of places are closed. It's a Thursday right now, it's around five. So you would think everybody would be getting off work, but it seems a little empty. Let's see if I can cross. Oh, yeah, let me cross. <laughs> Yeah, it seems a little, a little empty. Let me get in this store and see if I can get a plan. Got the Clado car, but I'm walking over a bridge. Let me show you some of this action right here. Yeah, I got the, uh, I got in there just in time. Cause right when I walked in there five minutes later, they uh, put the clothes sign. And it wasn't even six yet. So I got there just in time. Right across here. The plan was for one month, $20. $20 uh, for eight gigs of internet, which is way more than I needed. But 20 bucks, but the total came out to 27. I was talking to a girl on the, uh, on the plane. She was from Puerto Rico. She was, I was like, hey, how much is like a, do you have like menu del dias? She was telling me, Basically, the, the cheap meals here, or the affordable and expensive ones, like around eight to $10. That's pretty much beans, rice, and a plantain. Eight, 10 bucks. I was like, ooh. Oh. So I'm gonna get used to that, eating a lot of beans and rice, but it's okay, it's pretty, it's supposed to be healthy for you. Beans, we got this, okay. And then straight ahead, if we keep going, uh, well, if we keep going, it's the beach. But let's see where this place is. Did an ice cream shop straight ahead, pharmacy? Oh, it's right here, to the right. Right, let me show you guys the menu. Here's the name right here. Here go the prices. Soups around eight bucks. Uh, if you want a small one though, five dollars. Specials of the day. You guys see the prices. Uh, I don't do pork, but nine bucks. Cotton mm, maybe side of nine bucks. Okay, so we uh, might get this one right here. One half. Barbecue, nine bucks. Seafood, if you're feeling a little fancy. And then steaks, 20 bucks. Oh man, in Argentina, this would be like, I don't know, seven, seven dollars, six bucks in Argentina. And then, oh, they have some more. All right, let me go ahead and order. And I'll show you guys what it looks like. 
Got to start off the trip right with a local dish called mofongo. Uh, right on top, you have some chicken. But mofongo is a mashed plantain dish, plantain. They usually have some garlic and some stuff inside. I forgot all the, the spices and the herbs, but plantain is the main dish. And then you can top it off with whatever you want. Obviously, I got chicken. You can do shrimp, anything else. Then we got the iceberg salad lip. And uh, I'm missing the plantains, but all right, now the full meal is here. I dug in, I dug in already. And uh, don't, let the, um, don't let the look fool you. These plantains are fried, I didn't know that. They fry it first and they mash it and they do all, the, all that good stuff. And they got some more plantains. It's a plantain feast right here. The sweet ones, green ones. And then there we go. Ooh, that meal was, was pretty good, it was filling. Definitely filling, mofongo. I had that when I was in the DR, but I believe it's from Puerto Rico. I think it was, uh, originated here, if I'm not mistaken. Mashed plantains, sweet plantain. Okay, I can't cross. One more stop, and then headed back to the room. Remember, today is just a chill day, just getting settled in. I literally got off the plane like maybe two hours ago, and I had to rush to get to that Clado store to get the uh, internet. But so far, everything's going well. Everything's going as planned. We're gonna hop in this market and I'll show you guys maybe some of the prices. Give you guys an idea what I was thinking about visiting in the future. I don't think you need a mask. Or, nope. I see people up in there with no mask on, so we'll do the same. Grab one of these baskets. Get this one right there. All right. Let's see, let's see. Gotta get the fruits and veggies, guys. Let's go over here. Grab some of these juices. Let's see what. All right, there's a lot of prices. I'm gonna just name some of these off. Look like the the smoothies around two dollars seventeen cents. Fruit cups three dollars fifty cents. Uh, if you want a fruit bowl, a larger one, like around seven dollars four dollars. I prefer the fruit from the street cart on the corner. But it's okay. All right, we're in the juice section. Ooh, better me some. Ah, shout out to Mexico, Jarritos. About a dollar. Uh, juices, orange juice around a dollar. Snapple, dollar. More ocean spray, AKA sugar water, $3. One gallon, $2. Obviously it depends on if you want the fancy water, I guess with the minerals and stuff added, or you just want something simple. You know, smart water, Fiji, all that stuff. Uh, I'm trying to get one of these. 55 cents. I tend to snack, so let's see what they have here. Oh man, my kryptonite are these right here. About a dollar. I'll grab one. Show you some of the beers. Budweiser. Damn. If you want something a little fruitier. Damn. Here goes the cereals right here. Don't judge, we all have our different tastes. We got Fruity Pebbles, Cocoa Pebbles, Honey Bunches of Oats, Cinnamon Toast Crunch, Cheerios, Fruit Loops, Corn Pops. I used to eat these, I don't like these anymore. We got, what else? We got Frosted Flakes. Something for everyone. Uh, let me see. I'm in the cleaning aisle, but I think you guys get the point, man. The prices are pretty much the same uh, or similar. So I guess you would say the average price in the U.S., depending on where you're at, someplace more expensive, someplace cheaper. So I'm probably going to go ahead and end it right here. Appreciate you guys watching. 
Hope you guys found some value in the video. Remember, just a quick little, you know, how I settle in. Nothing crazy, nothing fancy. Most of you guys know that. But anyways, I uh, appreciate you guys watching. And I'll catch you guys at the next one. Deuces.